What's going on guys, JTM Off-Road here. Today's video, I want to let you know what I think about the new Jeep Gladiator. So I just want to let you guys know right off the bat, this is not a video listing specs of the new Jeep Gladiator. This is just a video stating my thoughts. So I'm sure a lot of you have been anticipating this uh, like I have. Um, over the years, I've seen many, many concepts showing up of what a new Jeep truck might look like. And honestly, I'm a little, I'm a little surprised by with what they came out with. They did state in the video there were differences between the JL and the new Jeep Gladiator. Appearance-wise, there's really not a whole lot. I mean, it pretty much looks like a JL with a bed on it. And to a lot, I think ever I think there's going to be a lot of people that really like this. And you know, if I had the money, maybe I would buy one. I'm I'm not sure yet. Chances are I see it. I haven't seen a price yet, but I have a feeling it's going to be really high. I would say at least 50, 60,000. Um, it, that, that's just my, my opinion. I kind of feel like they took an easy way with this for a midsize class truck. It seems like it's going to be really capable. And I think a lot of people are going to have fun with the fact that it's a Wrangler and a truck. So you kind of get a little of best of both worlds. People are going to be able to take their doors off and their top off and still be able to have a truck, which is going to be a whole new kind of feature. Um, that's something you'll be able to buy from a dealer. But honestly, what I would have loved to see, and I'm sure a lot of you will agree, is something more along the lines of a full-size truck, something that could have a higher tow capacity, something a whole different platform than the Wrangler. Now I know that the concept cars are, you know, kind of like shown what the company's capable of, that they still have a creative design and everything, but there have been two concepts that I'm aware of over the years that were more directed towards like an M715 platform from, you know, back in the late 60s. That is what I would have really loved to see. That would be more along the lines of a full-size truck. That could be something that they put a V8 in, higher tow capacity, something along those lines. That's what I'd personally like to see. I don't know if that's ever going to happen. I doubt it is, especially with the way everything's going. It seems all about aerodynamics and gas mileage and everything like that. I don't know. Who, who knows what they'll come up with. Um, I know in the video today that they released that they had said after another year, they're going to be releasing the Jeep with a diesel engine and it said it was capable of producing 440 foot-pounds torque. It seems like everyone wants to have a diesel and it's, it's coming. And, but in the, today's video, they, I don't know, they seemed like they were hyping it up a good bit. I, I don't know if they're actually going to do it, but it seems like it's heading that way. So that's, that's kind of something cool to look forward to. I'm not completely dogging on, on the Jeep. It, it, looks, it, looks, it looks cool. I like it. I was just a little surprised. I know... There's been leaked photos, you know, coming out um, for months of what it looks like. And, you know, I, I kind of had an idea that, you know, that it's not going to be what I wanted to see in, in a new Jeep truck. Guys, I want to know what you think about this. It has been such a long time since there's been a Jeep truck. And I know lots of people have been really anticipating this release. It's been teased for years that they were going to release one. And they finally did. And... I feel like a lot of people were really excited, and I feel like a lot of people were really let down. So, I don't know. First off, I'm going to say, I don't have the money to buy one anyway. So, my opinion's not all that strong. But just sitting from the wayside, looking at what's coming out, and, you know, for years I've been waiting to see what happens. Maybe they will come out with a full-size one someday. I don't know. Probably not. But I can dream, right? I'm sure I'm probably leaving out a couple ideas that I was thinking about, but those were the main thoughts. So, guys... I know a lot of you have some strong opinions and thoughts on this, so drop them down in the comments. I want to read them. I know everybody else wants to read them. It can be a huge discussion. So go ahead and drop those comments down there. If this is your first time to the channel, 
be sure to subscribe. Check out my other videos. I got a YJ. It's certainly not anything close to a JL Jeep truck, anything like that. But it gets beat up off-road and I have a great time with it. So be sure to check out my other videos. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Go down in the description. I have shirts for sale through Teespring. Check that out. I appreciate you coming and listening to what I had to say. And I think that's it for this video, guys. We'll see you in the next one. Oh,